Hit the lights, James. What's up, fellow Wolfpack members? Tom Wolf here, and welcome to episode 7 of Silent Hill 2 for the Tom Wolf Playthrough Edition. So in last episode, um, Laura locked us in a room with some weird monster thing that tried to kill us. I don't know why she did that. She's kind of a little bitch. And now let's go through the hospital again. And when we enter, things aren't as going to be as they seem as they once were before in the hospital. So that'll be interesting. It's like all bloody and shit. And here's a save point I'm going to save right now. And... I'm definitely gonna save. <laughs> James like, mm, nah. no, you're gonna save. Because <laughs> I actually died by accident before I started this episode. So that was kind of stupid of me. Some nurse of a crowbar is like, you got a treatment. It's like, get away from me. But she killed me. She was a bitch. I'm like, I didn't schedule that appointment. But I did. Mm -hmm. It's like, come on. <laughs> These nurses, they're so like, ugh. So, this is like the nurse that killed me, by the way. Whoa! <laughs> Are you doing good now? <laughs> I wish you had like a more satisfying kick, James. You just kind of lazily kick him. You're just like, eh. It's like, no! Kick their head off like Leon Scott Kennedy in Resident Evil 4. He's a badass. Y you're kind of badass, but I just like your Mary. I like your dark impression. It's funny. So, I just wanted to get a first aid in that room, and now we go to the second floor, and we gotta find the key, and you know, solve more puzzle bullshit. I mean, what else is new in Silent Hill? <laughs> it's fun, though. It's a fun game. Definitely fun. So, I think I go to this. Sorry if I'm going a little too fast, but that's just... Oh, shit! <laughs> Here, I'll... I'll crowbar you. I wish I could use. <laughs> I wish I could use um. What the heck? Angela's knife. It's like some of like jelly. Ow! Son of a bitch! I'm gonna smack your balls. Dude, you're like retarded. <laughs> Just hit her. <laughs> you don't even sound like a lady. <laughs> what, Mary? <laughs> Bitch. Yeah, you better die. Is she seriously not dead? I was gonna say, like, what? <laughs> Alright. Was that all that was in this room? Oh, I thought they were hiding something from me. Like they usually do. <laughs> um, God, where do I go? Oh, no, I gotta think. Oh, I gotta use the map. I gotta think really fast. I'm so sorry about that. Oh, that was M4. I need to go to M6. Okay. Because 6 is my favorite number. It's like, I won't forget. <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> Back off. <laughs> Why is this kill? Fuck. Why is this camera angle so shitty? <laughs> Why the hell is it so dark, too? It's not fair, they use it to like their advantage, they're, they're like, make it darker than possible, but I'm blind! I'm gonna make it darker still, fuck you! <sighs> okay, handgun, I know there's a key in here. So I had to go to M6, I'm sorry about going to M4, but hey, hey, you know. I was locked up inside the basement's basement, oh my god, it was so small and dark and I was so afraid. I dropped my precious ring, but I'll never ever go back there. Hmm dry cell battery and a basement store key and my heart is pumping because my controller is vibrating it's like help me it's like okay so i need a first aid and you know what fuck these nurses i'm gonna use a freaking go a little what the heck is this called a 9mm whatever it's called <laughs> my nine millimeter gun <laughs> oh yeah you weren't even looking pay attention honey Oh wow, you like that, huh? <clears throat> Fucking freak. <laughs> Nurse freak. Actually, I don't even think I need to go. Okay. And you go to room... Um, 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 three, I believe. I think you go to three. I actually accidentally went back, and I just cut that part out, just ignore what I did, but you go to room three, and then you go down the 
staircase somehow. Okay, there's like a staircase you have to go down. So let's check our map really fast. Okay, so the the staircase is by examination room four, I believe. If I'm wrong, I'm sorry. <laughs> well, let's check it out really fast. Before she gets <laughs> It's extremely dark, and I can't see jack crap. Okay, go. Okay. We're getting this. Okay. This game is really dark, and it's hard to keep track of where to go exactly. It's really hard. But, I do my best. Alright, so now we go to the basement, because we got a basement room key. And basements are always located at the bottom floor, at your convenience. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> I'm like, turn off the light. Nah. Nah. It's already dark enough, James. <laughs> Fine, you're lost. Oh, that was weird. Alright. So now we use the basement room key. And we're in the basement now. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> okay. Some handgun. Alright, and there's some bloody footprints. <laughs> bloody handprints on this shelf. Yes. <laughs> bloody footprints. <laughs> well, there they are enemies with, like, foot- like, feet for hands and stuff. Those, like, weird doll things. <laughs> uh, yeah. Okay, so now let's go in here. James! Mary? Oh, Maria. It's you. I thought you were... Sorry. Anyway... I'm glad you're alive. Anyway? What do you mean, anyway? You don't sound very happy to see me. I was almost killed back there. Why didn't you try to save me? All you care about is that dead wife of yours. I've never been so scared in my whole life. You couldn't care less about me, could you? No, I... Just then stay with me. Don't ever leave me alone. You're supposed to take care of me. <laughs> so, what about Laura? Did you find her? Yeah, but she ran away. We've got to find her. You really seem to care about her. Do you know her? I've never met her before. I just feel sorry for her. She's all alone. And for some reason, I feel like it's up to me to protect her. Hmm. I have like a theory, you know? Like, I wonder if Laura's actually our kid. That's just my theory, you know? Because Maria is so hot for James. <laughs> I, th I feel like she's like trying to take over Mary or something. I feel like Maria's up to something that we don't know about. Copper ring. Maria, what are you up to? <laughs> you know, this, this shit's going down and stuff. Oh, yeah. <laughs> There's something up with Maria. That's all I'm going to say. At least that's what I think. I could be totally wrong here. Alright, so Maria's back with us here. <laughs> this playthrough is so awesome again! <laughs> Not really. <laughs> Sorry, James. Man, how much stairs do you have to go up? Jeez. <laughs> oh, it is all the way to the third floor. Okay. And now I go in the elevator. I know, it's like a lot of back and forth you have to do in this game, and that's why I'm doing a walkthrough of it, oh my god, <laughs> instead of, uh, like, this me wondrously looking for shit, because this would take me, like, at least two hours if I didn't know where I was going. Why didn't you reload your gun? Are you fucking kidding me? <laughs> what happened to my bullets? I ate them. Really? <laughs> oh, I guess James is just really slow at reacting. I mean, I had 10 bullets and he didn't shoot. Whatever. Alright, so now I go to the first floor with Maria. And something really weird happened, so... <laughs> Look at her shadow. <laughs> so long. Hey there, everybody. Thanks for tuning in. Welcome to another exciting edition of... 
As you heard from the riddle, that's from the, going down to the first floor. You don't even need to be in the first floor. I just wanted to show you that. And on the third floor, he said the storage room, and that's where you answered the question. So it was like one, two, or three. Sorry I couldn't be there for the time explaining it, but I wanted you to hear the whole thing anyway. And I was going to mute my voice anyway, and I had to call some people because I'm busy, and I have to beat this really fast. So now we go to floor two. So if you go to floor one, you hear that uh, weird riddle that you just heard the three questions. And if you get one of them wrong, you are dead. But I know the, I know the answers already. Okay, so you just run all the way down here. <laughs> Bye, <guys. laughs> All right. Sorry, I'm really rushing today, actually. So now we're over here. And there is a fridge here that James could not open by himself, and you'll see right now. Will you open it? Yes, there's a fridge. But now we have Maria that we went to the basement, so... You can't open it? Yeah, Maria, give me a hand here. <laughs> yeah, I can't open it. You're supposed to be the big man around here. How's a little girl like me supposed to help? <laughs> You're taller than me. <laughs> They're like the same size. <laughs> Not very cute, is it? Now, like you, James. You, James. Mm -hmm. You take it. Mm, thanks. <laughs> Looks fancy. So we got a ring, and we got another ring when we went down the last. So now we have two rings, and that's all we need. Two rings. Okay. So now let's leave. <laughs> now we go to the elevator to the third floor, where I will show you where you use these two rings. Ow. <laughs> it's okay. I gotta take a hit. Two hits. <laughs> Okay, move, oh, you bitch. <laughs> okay, now 
now we go to the third floor where we could answer the riddle and you don't even need to do the riddle but i wanted to show you it the riddle is optional so you don't have to answer the questions right but i will yeah yeah <laughs> pretty much like the last question i didn't know but i, I didn't know the first two and i'll explain once i get to that room so it's in the storeroom where I could answer that riddle and claim my prize. I could actually just um, continue with the story, but I'm gonna go to the storeroom right now so I could answer the riddle. Okay, I'm gonna get some help just in case I die. Take a little sippy sippy of the medicine. See, I don't even know what I'm shooting at. Oh, <laughs> Piece of shit. <laughs> yeah, I know, right, James? Okay, so it's not that way, it's this way. Because it's so dark. Maria! <laughs> I'm really good at hitting you when you run. I hate that. I don't want to like keep using my ammo either. Ugh, it's so annoying. <sighs> the camera angle pisses me off sometimes in this game. Oh, there's no little health for me either. No? <laughs> wow! <laughs> Move, Maria. Shit. Hold on. <laughs> okay, I know the storeroom's unlocked. It's just I can't see for shit in this game sometimes. to constantly look at that stupid map. Nope, nope. <laughs> it's like, honestly, like, pin the tail in the donkey here. I can't see for freaking shit. Is it this? There we go. I can't see for shit in this game. Okay. And there's some nice items for me. First aid, handgun, shotgun. And here is where you enter the riddle. And this, like, little weird box right here. Which won't let me... Okay, thank you. <laughs> so the answer to the riddles... The first one is three, and it's on... And it, the name of the Silent Hill, it's... Um, I'll just show you it really fast. Sorry for doing this really uh, sloppy. Oh, I, I don't even have it. Oh, I wish I could show you the map. <laughs> oh, really? It won't show you? Oh, well, basically, it's... Um, God, I don't even remember what it's called, but basically it's three. It's not Silent Hill Town, and it's not the first one, but it's three. Man, that was shitty how I explained that. The second one, it was Sullivan, when we found in that trash, he was like, he murdered like the two kids, and then he suicided himself, so he's number one. And then the street that goes on forever in this game, it's Nathan Avenue, so it's three. Three, one, three. I forget what it's actually called. But basically you get to get like a shit ton of like like ammunition and crap, so it's very nice. And that's what you get for doing the riddle. You just get a bunch of ammunition, health and drinks, and all that good shit. You just hit the jackpot right over. <laughs> so now let's go back to the elevator where there's like the secret door and we're almost done with this now. So ow. <laughs> I thought you were dead. Fucking hell man. So right here. Sneaky sneaky. There's a painting of a woman on the door. Oddly enough, the hand part of the painting is actually 3D and sticks out. So, on the 3D part... Oh my god. You... Take some health. <laughs> and you put the rings on them. Because that part is 3D, so you combine the rings. Tell you the truth, I have no idea what that battery is for yet, this thing. But, yeah. We just use the two rings. I put the copper ring on the hand. And then I put the lead ring, and then it unlocked. And I'll click X before I get hit. There you go. Alright. Now we go down the stairs. <laughs> I'll push you down the stairs, Maria, if you don't move. There's a no on the ground inside. It's some kind of hard to read writing. I took the director's key, the one to the music. It's museum, so it's a museum. I hid it behind the praying woman. 
when I went out for the day trip. I picked it up, but I did not steal it. I'm not a criminal. It's definitely a kid writing, so that's probably like Laura, I'm guessing. So basically, she hid a key by a praying woman. Okay, and a museum, so hopefully that'll come in handy. <laughs> yeah, well, any Wolfpack members watching this playthrough, they'll just, feel like, they'll just forget in like five seconds because like I'm doing this really shittily, sadly now. It's like, Tom, I thought you were cool. It's like, I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm very sorry. Okay. Basically, we're gonna ha exit the hospital in a little bit. We're almost done, don't worry. And it will get better this game, I promise. I'm just kind of rushed today. Sadly. Okay. Basically, someone's chasing us. <laughs> Open up. Head's gonna eat tonight. Maria dies. I was like so sad when I first saw it. I was like, oh. like my mouth was open literally for like 30 seconds. I'm like, oh. <laughs> but even if I think about it now, Maria, there's something weird about her. It feels like I don't know. There's something weird about Maria, even though she just died. <laughs> That's so mean of me to say. I bet she was hiding something. What could she possibly be hiding, James? But she had some pizza and she didn't give me some. Oh, yeah, what a bitch. <laughs> like, what was she up to? I just wonder about Maria sometimes, because she was hitting on James pretty hard. And she's like, I'm here, Mary's not. I'm pretty, Mary's not. Like, that's what I feel like I was, that vibe I was getting from her. Oh, when I go here. I think I exit the hospital. I really like this music, it's nice. Oh! Before I get lost, I go to the director's room, by the way. Every door is locked, there's no point. I mean, I think there's some items you could get, but I don't need it for now. You just don't need it. You need to go to the director's room, you get the key out of the hospital, you're done. And I think this is the room. If I could find it. <laughs> I know this is the room. It's just like hiding from me, you know? He who is not bold enough to be stared at from across the abyss is not bold enough to stare into it himself. The truth can only be learned by marching forward. Follow the map. There's a letter and a wrench. So, basically, it's marking my positions where to go next. Hopefully, I'll find Mary soon. Hopefully, Pyramid Head didn't have a midnight snack. <laughs> Mary Sandwich? Mmm. Bloody Mary. <laughs> I got the hospital lobby key. And that helps me, you know, leave the hospital. Thank God. I had enough hospital visits. And that was Laura, I believe. Now we're gonna find her. <laughs> I wonder if James killed Laura and Mary. I just don't know. There's something weird about James, too. And now we exit, and we are going to end today's episode here. Once we're outside and stuff and get some nice fresh air, and remember to go outside, spend at least one hour outside today. Thanks for watching this episode of Tom Wolf. Maria's dead. I couldn't protect her. Once again, I couldn't do anything to help. As usual, Laura has run off somewhere. Again. <laughs> Mary, what, what should I do? Are you really waiting somewhere for me?
for? Is this your way of taking? I'm going to find Mary. It's the only thing I've left to hope for. Unless Pyramid had had him for a sandwich. <laughs> Alright. So, I am gonna end the episode. Well, actually, I mean, yeah. I guess we could just end the episode here. Yeah. Hope that's a save. No. I wish I could find a save, because I'd be much more smooth. Eh, we'll just end the episode here. We'll just end by the hospital again. Anyways, thanks for watching today's episode. I'll try and pick up the show better and make it more entertaining next time. But anyways, stay classy, always eat your pizza, and get ready for episode 8 of Silent Hill 2, Tom Wolf Playthrough Edition, all that good stuff. Boom!